AI isn't coming for our jobs. It's already here. But there is good news. You can make it your ally and not your enemy. I was reading this article from Built In. I'll link it for you guys. Basically, the author is saying if you're not talking about AI or using it at work, you're already behind. Because these companies are pouring billions, billions with a B, of dollars into automating tasks that we all once used to do. So we are not going to ignore and pretend it's not happening. We are going to study it. This is where I think you should start noticing what parts of your job that AI does really well and what parts are not so good. Then you want to double down on the thing that cannot be automated. A lot of the like soft skills, so reading people, navigating team dynamics, maybe understanding context that only a human can do. Well, for example, AI can whip up a sketchy wireframe. It can write some copy for me and then I can bring that in front of a customer that I'm talking to. AI can't read between the lines like I can when I'm in the interview with somebody. When they say, oh, this feature's fine, but their face says I'm never going to use it, AI can't pick up on those things. So in my case, I'm treating AI not as a threat, but as my little co-designer, my little co-conspirator. Have AI do the boring stuff. Automate that. And then you, as the human, can go and deep dive further where AI can't. I think AI is such, at least for tech, I'm speaking for people in tech, is literally a job requirement now. You're not gonna be able to skate by not knowing anything. Because guys, the future of tech isn't just AI, it's who can use AI well. And I want that to be all of us so we can keep our jobs out here.